good afternoon and welcome to your 9th Second News. I'm Carla Callahan. An investigation is underway after a 17-year-old girl died after taking a rogue ecstasy tablet at the weekend. School girl Regan Lenehan McCall collapsed at the Arches nightclub in Glasgow on Saturday. Four other clubbers were hospitalised after taking the pill known as Mortal Kombat. The bedroom tax will be axed from Scotland after Holyrood agreed to cover the cost of housing benefit cuts. Hailed as a victory for social justice, Nicola Sturgeon said that they were more than willing to put in the extra £15 million required. Hollywood stars have been paying tribute to Hunger Games actor Philip Seymour Hoffman who died at the weekend. The 46-year-old was found dead in his New York apartment after a suspected overdose. Tom Hanks, who described the actor as a giant talent, said this is a horrible day for those who worked with Philip. Neil Lennon has said that thugs could drive him out of Scottish football after he was attacked by fans at Tynecastle. The Celtic boss left the grounds after being pelted with coins and drinks during Aberdeen's League Cup semi-final against St Johnston. And finally, rock and roll came to Glasgow last night as the city's Hard Rock Cafe finished the three-day launch of the restaurant. And in true rock star style, Scottish band De Fratelli smashed up guitars at the cafe entrance before treating guests to a selection of songs. And that's all for your 90 second news. Join us again at the same time tomorrow. Bye for now.